Welcome to the 15th class on the structure and details of the second base of Mikdash. In this class, we're going to be talking about the Ta'im, which are the compartments that surround the Kodesh and Kodesh HaKadoshim. So there were 38 Ta'im around the Heichel, 15 on the north and 15 on the south. And the way it was structured is that there were three floors of five long Ta'im. So let's see the five long Ta'im. We have one on each side over here, on the north and south, then another one next to it, then a third one, a fourth one, and a fifth one. And each of these, as we'll show in the next slide, was three floors high, meaning these were long ta'im, and there were three floors of them. So we have over here five on each side, and if each side has three floors, that means 15 on each side. So for both sides, it's a total of 30. And then, in addition, there were eight on the west because there were two floors of three long time. So we see right away the three long compartments. And so they went up two floors. So that's three and three is six. And on the top floor, it just had two time. And it's discussed exactly how it was structured on the top floor. But the basic point is that there were just two time, two of these compartments on the top floor. So there's a total of eight compartments to the west. So we have a total between all of these compartments, a total of 38 compartments. Now just to get a perspective of this from a different direction, so if we were to imagine a person here standing in front of the Hechel, they would then enter the Hechel, and what would they see in front of them? This is what they would see. They would come into the Hechel, the full 100 Amas is on these two sides, from one end to the other. On the side here, we spoke about already, are the base Khalifas, two long hallways. And then over here would be the main entrance to the Kaidish. And like we learned in a previous class, there were two doors into the second ta. We'll see through these walls in a moment. From each side, the second compartment. The one to the left, which is to the south, was never used. The one to the right, to the north, this one was used. It was used to enter the ta'im. It was used to go up onto the roof of the Kodesh in order to fix things that needed to be fixed. And it was used to enter into the Kodesh, as we learned about some of these things in previous classes. Now, to like see through these walls, this is what would be what, what's on the other side of this wall. There were these five long compartments, like we saw from the bird's eye view in the previous slide. And as we can see over here, they were three floors high. Now there are many discussions exactly how the floors were divided in terms of their size and how high up they went. Did they go all the way to the top of the Eichel or did they only go up to the top of the first floor? Here we're presenting it that it just went one floor up. So if we look at the time over here, they cover the 40 Amas of the first floor. And then above that we have, as we learned in a previous class, a five Amma ceiling, then another floor that's 40 Amas, and then the five Amma roof. And with that, we'll end the 15th class.